English, English, okay, I'll have to wall off my, wall off my base. Get that barbican up nice and early. Mm. Maybe we'll check it up there. Mm. Yeah, that's good. And I will try and push the deer. Okay, I have all my shit. Okay, let's push this there. Okay, that's good. I'm not sure if I should get that forward gold. I am tempted because my Barbican will secure it. Hey guys, welcome. First game after the weekend. Oh crap. Looks like I lost... I gathered some... some wood but it looks like I lost it so I'm gonna try and get it back it's a little bit sloppy that'll do oh crap there's a scout. I'm a little bit concerned that he's going to punish this grief. But let's have a look at what he does. So we want the Barkin right here. Protect that. Um, protect that gold and... Food. Oh dear, this guy should not be here. Yeah, he's with five villagers, so he's really pushing it. He's really pushing it. I'm trying to see where I, I placed the barbican here. I need to protect the food. Yeah, he's being super aggressive here. It's already halfway done. Yeah, that would be good. Thing. Very aggressive play by him. I think I'll be on time. I'm trying to see. Where am I going to get my wood from, though? Don't know where I'm gonna get my wood from, which is gonna be an issue, actually. Let's panic and do that as well. New to the game, how is the matchup usually played? Uh, this is a bit of a weird map, so it's very different to how it's normally played, but he's going hyper aggressive in Feudal Age. I'm trying to get my Barbican up. He is going to be able to harass me pretty well here. I have no. I have no wood really. I need wood. I wonder what he's doing at his base. Not on stone. 
Yeah, he's, I was trying to pull the boar. I could do the Imperial Academy. I'm not sure if that's a little bit too greedy. I may as well, eh? Yeah, this is really frustrating. This is really frustrating. Really frustrating. We got to build villages. Yeah, it's just building mass longbows. So, how about you get that? That'll be a little safer. We don't know what he's up to. Ah, uh, it's not on the wood. That's pretty sloppy. I don't know if he's fast casting behind this. Ah, uh, villager's dead. Pretty bad. Yeah, I really don't know what he's up to. Yeah, I don't know what he's up to now. I assume he's fast castling behind this. Not sure. Are you the highest ranked American? No, not at all. I am not. I mean, I'm from New Zealand. And there are, there are many American players better than me. So he's aged up, which is very bad. Very bad. Yeah, it's not even worth it. Problem is, he's going to be up. He's going to have a bunch of units. And what have I got? I would expect him to go knights. Maybe I can go some spears. Thanks for the follow, Purple Ranger. It's a really nice build by him. Super aggressive. Maybe I shouldn't have built my... Um... Yeah, let's still... Let's not give up right yet. Just yet. It's going to be pretty tough. It's going to take the central relic. I think I can take this. Yeah, he's given up on those. Who knows? They're dead. Okay, that's nice. Knights. So it is knights. It's going to be the issue. Yeah, so he's got knights. 
He's gonna take that relic. Can't really prevent it, I think. Just start playing. Welcome, Purple Ranger. Yeah, fair enough. So he's gonna get that, which is a problem. Floppy. I need um need those relics I said oh, crap oh my scout's dead Let's try and panic up that outpost. What are you doing, mate? Yeah, that's good. I need... Oh, nice. I don't have them um, elite yet. Let's wall that off. Let's wall that off there. Yeah. Way too much food. Okay. Right. That's good. I just want to check this is. I don't actually know. Okay. I thought I clicked that. I would love to get rid of that. I'm not sure if I can. Is he on the hunt? Doesn't look like he's on the hunt. Wouldn't mind a blacksmith. I'm not sure if this is worth diving. Probably not. It would have been very expensive. You know what? I don't think this is worth it anymore either. Okay, let's grab that wheelbarrow. We've stabilized. Thanks, Obama. Very nice little dives by him. I gotta be paying attention to avoid that. I can't afford to bleed those villagers. Can't afford to bleed those villagers. Doing, mate. How much time is left? Not that much time. Oh, 
That's nice. Got a free knight. Might be expecting um, siege from him now. Yeah, he's got the sprinkles there. He's got the sprinkles. Food is going to be an issue. Let's get that. Let's get that. Yeah, it's just going to be a siege where I'm going to run out of food very soon. I need way more wood. Get that tech. I have no... Okay, that's good. I think he should be safe behind the... Let's have a look we can raid a little bit. It's all about the Springles now. Jeez Louise, mate. That's pretty bad. I have no, no more food. It's getting a little bit outplayed here. Okay, and I have no food, right? No food. Need a market. Looking pretty grim. Assume has walled that off. It's got zero on gold. I don't actually. Oh, he's getting a key. It's nice, hopefully I don't get caught out of position. Tell me. 
Yeah, I think it's ten. What the heck happened to this? Oh, wrong control. Let's just wall this. Make sure we're good here. What's up? What's up? Okay, that's fine. Down. 
Nice. Nice. Wow, that was sick. Wow, that was sick. Oh, I think that's the very first time I bit Kiliadi. A bit of a meme map, meme map, so it doesn't really count as... Oh, my heart rate. My heart rate. A bit of a meme map, so it didn't really, it doesn't really count as a real win, but I'm, I'm super happy with it. Especially those 30 seconds left on the sacred side, that was really close. Um, I think he played better, he had really nice longbow picks at the start, he had nice knight picks. I managed to get the siege up, so I had siege superiority, I had more springles, my springles have more. Oh, thanks Purple Ranger, thanks Gobama. Thanks everyone, Flacco. Birdie. Yeah, those nests of bees, eh? Those nests of bees are legit. And then, I feel like after his initial push failed, for some reason I had way more resources. I wonder whether that's just because Chinese power. Oh, I killed a lot of villagers with those night raids. So that was well worth it. The knights and the siege fights aren't too valuable, especially if they're keeps on the field. But it looks like I killed like 5-6, five, 5-6 six, five, six there. And then, to be honest, it looks like he stopped building villages. Maybe... Um, yeah, I'm not sure what that's about. But... Wow. That was really nice. Yeah, exactly. The, the Imperial officials, right? He boosts all my wood is 20% more. This is inefficient. Well, my gold is 20% more. That's really nice. Now I have so much risk. And I just had more military after that fight, huh? So he had more before the fight. Um, but the nest of bees leveled it out, right? A uh, nest of bees decapped the sacred site. Wow. I wonder if he, uh, if he pulls every single one of his villagers, whether he's fine. Because there were only 30 seconds left. And there was a keep here. So the villagers would kill the nest of bees. Because he was sort of all in anyway, right? If that didn't work, then it's tough. Exactly, Flacco. That's pretty sweet as the the economy of China. And then because he didn't have enough villagers, I just have way more eco. Oh, that was sick. Stoked about that. And it's on this map, you definitely want these little walls. Because sometimes you're safe and the wood blocks it off, and sometimes you're not. And then four knights can show up in your eco and you're, you're stuffed. But anyway, well, what a day to start the game. What a game to start the day with. <laughs> All right, let's do the notes and then we'll hop into another game. So this was mountain clearing. Chinese versus English. 25 minutes win. So this is cool. I've never beaten Kilyadi before. I don't know where he's from. I gotta look that up. Kilyadi. Okay, so what was good? Um, scouting his super fast feudal, therefore uh, rushing Barbican. If I hadn't gotten the Barbican up in time, it would have been genius. Did you add your notes for this match? No, I'm about to. I'm just, just writing the notes. Um... Scouting his early knights, therefore spear defense. Defense. Siege superiority. Mass springles. Second workshop. Because as, as the Chinese, you, you, you start, you automatically have the clock tower, which is a workshop. But one clock tower is not enough. You're gonna, on this map, you're gonna need a second workshop, and then you need an imperial official, and you need to pump out units. Barbecue, lol, not that. Oh, yes, 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 okay. Yeah, people keep laughing at that. I don't know what it stands for, but uh, I haven't Googled it yet. Mass Pringles. Okay, Night Raids. Night Raid on his stone. That was great. That killed like 10 plus builds for six knights. At that stage of the game, I think that is what really gave me the equally. Barbecue, yeah, yeah I, I know what barbecue is. I know what barbecue is. Uh, I, some people have been saying BBC stands for something rude or something, because I always did BBC. I just know the TV show, not TV show, the news channel, BBC. Improve. Okay, so... Be aware... 
be more aware versus longbows and early knights. Lost a bunch of fills. So he would did a really good job of diving in with his longbows and with his knights. I had spears when the knights were there, but they just weren't in the right position. Okay, that was sick. Yeah, don't type that. Yes, I will. Thanks, Rungy Golf. Really happy with that. 